an intense search lasting two days. Police and the defense force finally made contact with the soldier. He then agreed to hand himself over. The soldier was apparently in hiding in Inanda. His shooting spree started on Tuesday at the home of his fiancée. This after he allegedly opened fire on her family, killing her sister and injuring another. Later, he was involved in a shootout with police where two more people were injured. He didn't want to hand over himself to the SAPS so far. As the Defence Force is our member, we felt that it is our duty that if our member is saved, that he wants to, to hand over himself that we must make sure that us, as the South African National Defence Force, that we go and get our member. The suspect was also alleged to have stolen military gear and a weapon from his base in Appington in the Northern Cape. That weapon had been found. He was having the R4 with him, which he handed over uh, to our military police. His fiancé's family, who've been in hiding over the past day, say they are shocked but relieved. The suspect faces multiple charges including murder, attempted murder and kidnapping. He is expected to appear at the Ntuzuma Magistrate's Court on Monday. I am Mklongo, SABC News, Inanda.